hope you're well. I hope you're all having a really lovely day. It is Friday here, as you might be able to see. I'm having quite a nice relaxing morning, just getting ready for the day slowly and doing my makeup. Every month, Rick goes on a golf day with his friends, so I always try and have at least one day where I also, you know, I don't go and play golf, but I just have a nice relaxing sort of like self-care day. Um, so today is gonna be really fun for me, hopefully. Um, the baby is downstairs with Rick. It's a Friday. Did I just say it's a Friday? Um, so he's downstairs with Ricky. The boys are at school and I'm just getting ready. I'm trying to do my makeup bag up, but it's not working. I'm going to have to sort through that and maybe take some stuff out. We are going to the decorative living fair today, which is just my cup of tea. Um, I only recently heard about it actually on Instagram. But it's in Tunbridge Wells, I believe. So not too far from us. So I thought why not go have a look around it looks really nice we went to an antiques fair much earlier on in the year it was like in january or something really 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 cold day and it was lovely but it was all very much as you probably as i should have expected very antiquey um maybe things that aren't quite my style um so this one looks a little bit more like french brocan brocant is it brocant brocante I don't actually know. It seems like it's that kind of vibe. Um, so yeah, we're just gonna have a little mooch around today and hopefully have quite an enjoyable time, maybe pick up a few things. I don't know, I don't know what prices are like, I don't know what it's gonna be, what stalls are gonna be there, but anyway, we'll take you with us because I know a lot of you guys love that kind of thing too. So. Hopefully it could give you some inspiration for styling your own home or um, you might even want to visit yourself if you haven't been there already. Yeah, I've just done all my makeup. To be honest, I don't think I'm going to do much with my hair. Uh, I might just leave it like that actually, not too... I'm just going to go and get dressed, but before I do it, I just wanted to quickly show you these absolutely gorgeous pyjamas that I was sent from Lily Silk. They're a little bit creased because obviously I slept in them, um, but I just love them. Lily Silk is a company that um, I've heard about for the last few years now, and they're becoming so well known within the silk um fashion space because they sell so many beautiful products. They've got everything from like gorgeous luxurious pajamas in all different colors but they have shirts they also sell cashmere um, but they also do all the bedding as well so you can get beautiful silk pillowcases in all different colors and they're 100 percent mulberry silk um so yeah they're such a lovely lovely brand and honestly these feel incredible i just think that everybody should have a lovely pair of pajamas for those self-care days when you wake up you know you're not in a rush and you can just like feel a, feel that little bit special and luxurious i chose the um avocado green color of course <laughs> but they have some gorgeous colors i really love the cream um like ivory color and they do a really beautiful pink pair as well but obviously they've got all of the classic colors so this is their gift packaging and all of their packaging is like recyclable reusable so you could pick this if maybe you were gifting it to somebody i was thinking as well like how lovely would this be for a bride in white something like that but let's let's open this one together because i'm just so excited so luxe So this is what I chose. So this is a very beautiful little blouse, as you can tell, obviously, from Lily Silk. It's 100% silk, but it has these little pearl buttons on it. How gorgeous are they? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna quickly go and steam this, um, and then I'll show you my outfit before we go. Okay, so this is what the blouse looks like. It's so, so pretty. I've just thrown it on with a pair of my jeans because I still need to be comfortable to walk around today. But the reason I chose this is because I just think it's such a versatile little shirt. Um, obviously it's white, so it will go with anything, but you could dress it up if you were going to work. It'd be a really nice work shirt or even going out for the evening. Um, but you can also just dress it down by having it open a little bit. I've thrown on like my gold jewelry um, and I feel like that makes it look a little bit more um, casual and modern 
And yeah, I really, really love this. What I'm going to do is, because the weather's really odd at the moment, if you live in the UK, you'll know it is May, but one minute it's raining and it's quite cold and windy, the next minute it's like burning sunshine. So I'm going to throw this over the top. Hello, Finley. You're looking very smart. Um, I'm just going to chuck this over the top, I think. And then, again, this will give it a little bit more of a casual vibe, which then I think lends it to looking nice, like the outfit looking nice with a pair of trainers, um, which I think I'm gonna have to wear because again, I really wanna like put my sandals and stuff on, but I think we're gonna be outside quite a lot. The stalls are outside, so it's probably on grass and where it's been quite wet this week. I'm really better off to wear boots, but I think I'll probably get away with some trainers because it's not, fingers crossed, looking too bad today. But yeah, this, I love this. Finley's just destroying the room. <laughs> Look at this, it's just so pretty. Look at the detail. So it's got the little pearly cuffs. This little guy's got a shirt on. Are you ready to go to the decorative living fair, sir? Yeah. Let's take this out. Are you ready to go to the decorative living fair? Yeah. Yeah? He had a little bit of an accident this morning. I don't know how much you can see, but his lip is so swollen. One poor baby. <laughs> Happened. Oh. I'm so sorry. He fell over and I think he's bit his his teeth's gone through his lip. Oh, baby. So I'll show you my finished look when I've got my shoes and my bag and everything on. Um, but please check out Lily Silk if you want to look for some beautiful silk pieces. The next thing on my list is definitely going to be some silk bedding because I've really been getting into like silk pillowcases and um, hair scrunchies and things over the last few years because I know they're so good for your hair and for your skin and stuff in general. So I'm definitely gonna be looking into that, but I'll put all of the links for Lily Silk in the description box below so you can go and find out more and um, get yourself something fabulous, basically. <laughs> Shall we go? Yeah. Let's go, say bye. Can you wave? No. <laughs> yeah. Why would you do so we've just got here unfortunately the weather is not looking great um there's a poor lady to the left of me that's just been told to park up and she's got stuck so um hopefully i think she's getting some help now um but yeah <laughs> I don't know how successful today is going to be. I don't, I, we've not been here before, so I'm not sure if there's much indoors or if it's all outdoors or how it works, but we're going to go and take a look. Hopefully it will be worth the trip um, and that we don't get too soaking wet. <laughs> Stars come to shine when it's dark from so far away show us where we are What makes the sun go to sleep every night and what's it dreaming of? I wonder Sky sometimes hides behind the clouds. Maybe it's just like me, a little bit scared of heights. Why does the rain always keep on pouring down when it's gray outside? It really makes me wonder.
where we are. Hi guys, I'm so sorry, I've been absolutely rubbish today. So whilst we were there, even though it was absolutely gorgeous, I loved that so much. I feel like I finally found a fair, like a, a antique vintage fair that is just my kind of style. It's so beautiful. But I got the worst bloody headache in the world um, whilst I was walking around just before we got there and it just got worse and worse and worse. I had to come home and go to bed for a bit. Um, luckily it's gone off quite a bit now, I just feel quite groggy. But, oh, that was horrible. Um, but the boys are home from school now, and my nan and granddad have come round. It's Nan and Pat Pat Friday. <laughs> they always pop in on a Friday, so they've been here for a little while. We've been having teas and coffees, and it's just been really nice. But I feel like I've let the vlog down, um, so I will try and carry on the rest of today and tomorrow filming as well. Hello. <laughs> sorry, to, sorry to just put you on camera. I was just saying that you come round every Friday, so you're. We just had a nice tea and a coffee. A bit like a dustbin, really, haven't we? Oh yeah. <laughs> once, once a week. And Pat Pat's been playing with Finn. Yeah, we've had a game, haven't we? Finley yeah. Patrick. Finley Patrick. Yeah. yeah. What's Nanny got? What's Nanny got? What is it? Is it Baba? Give Baba a kiss. Aww. What's your baby's name? Your baby's name's Yeah. Train. Train. Choo choo. Yes, we did try and film a speed clean, but we had to do it in such a quick time. You wouldn't think it would take any longer to film a speed clean than it does to just clean. But moving the camera to follow where you are and the fact that me and Rick were trying to do it in like record time, we couldn't film both of us, it just didn't work out right. So I do really want to film a speed cleaning video soon. Just need to do it on a different day when we weren't in a rush to get things done. But I will show you if the clips were any good. Um, a bit of it, I'll insert it into this video so you get a little bit of a speed clean. And also I started to organise some of my pantry jars, which is something that I've wanted to do for so long. I only did a few, but something that very much made me happy. So I know some people are a little bit like, what is the point of this? This is just the kind of thing I love. <laughs> so um, hopefully you enjoy that as well. Like the day before You're like a stone on my pillow I don't make a sound when I shut the door oh, You don't have to wake up yet oh, We can spend all day in bed I'll put the TV in the room We'll have a Netflix Marathon, KG saxophone We'll order in a bunch of food I'll put your favorite music on All the way baritone oh, yeah. Shut the lights, go in front
Push your favorite music on all the way baritone Shut the lights, go in front know that this house looked like that <laughs> just two days ago <laughs> pristine I know just a couple of days ago the house makes was me sick beautiful and now it's a state again what <coughs> happens when you've got kids this little guy's just woken up from his nap what's Finn you been doing then <laughs> yeah I haven't been there <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. say hello yeah and you wave yeah go ahead let me wave you do a big wave yeah. to everyone. Yeah. You, yeah, you say yeah, but can you do it? Go ahead, wave. Finley, wave. No. Oh, is he gonna be shy? Ricky's made me some lovely lunch. This looks so, so nice. They look like very good poached eggs. Oh, this looks really nice. Just what we have leftovers from the fridge, really. That is a good egg. all of his little imaginary play stuff um his kitcheny bits this is one of my favorite toys i always recommend this to every parent of toddlers <laughs> he's like yeah. you're talking to well, mum yeah. um let me just talk for a sec he just wants the camera um it's the leapfrog ice cream cart we've had this for years it was the boys and it's still going strong we have lost a couple of pieces along the way but it's not doing too bad he loves playing with this and then all of his wooden kitchen well, it's not kitchen yeah, actually, it's just on the table, it? but it's um, a dessert uh, shop, a uh, till, his trolley and wooden fruit. Some of this stuff is from the boys as well, um, but this was all from Aldi. So, so good. He got it uh, mainly for Christmas and his birthday, even though he was way too young. But I always try and get him things for the next year because otherwise it'll just be, it won't be worth it. So he's really starting to play with it now. Not so much in an imaginary way, but... Well, he does like making the ice creams, but he prefers to just throw things around. <laughs> oh, and this was from Ikea, this little table and chairs. If you looked it up close, it is in a real state. I need to sand it and paint it all, but we got this back out for him as well, and he really, really likes sitting on here like a big boy, don't you? Don't you? Yeah. Yeah, big boy. Hello, sir. Could I have some cake, please? No. Oh! Thank you, that's so kind. How much is that? How many pennies? Three? Three pennies? Okay. Sorry, I only have one, is that okay? There's your money, thanks so much, bye. Bye. <laughs>